Ranty panties. Videos whenever. Thank you. Life's about to get supremely interesting. Hey guys, welcome back. It's been a while. And uh, today I'm unboxing something. Got something from a Supreme Drop. Um, and you know, let's talk about it. First of all, why does Supreme discriminate against larger people? I like a lot of their clothes. The drops are very cool. But the few times that I've tried and I've actually made it in time to be able to order something, they only stop at a size extra large. What, people that are 2X, 3X, 4X, 5X and up, they don't wanna get expensive t-shirts or jackets or coats, come on. So uh, being that I'm a big person, uh, the majority of purchases that I could make, if anything, are home goods. And as you can see surrounding, I love home goods. I love to get accessories and home stuff. Uh, so uh, let's uh, take a look. So one of the first great resources I found is a account on Twitter. It's called Supreme Drops. And they kind of get all the information for you. They let you know what the website layout is going to be out. They tell you how much the stuff is going to go for, sell out times in Europe. And I've kind of really been scouring it throughout this pandemic every time there is a new drop just to see if there's anything that I like and I would check it out. Plus, I always found it interesting how Nike drops would happen on like Wednesdays at 1045 and then the Supreme drops would always happen on Thursdays at 11 a.m. Um, Eastern Standard Time for me anyway. So... Something I liked from the minute the full fall collection got released were these vases. And they were like these bondage type vases. And I thought it was the coolest thing in the world. So on that day, Thursday, the, of the most recent drop from week 12, I immediately jumped online to get it. And surprisingly, I was able to jump on it. You know, I don't know why, but I personally feel that people don't pay much attention to the home stuff, but I find the home stuff interesting. There was a Supreme Drop vase a few years ago where it kind of shows like nudity and other types of like Roman or Greek type figures. And on eBay, they all go for hundreds of dollars. I haven't found anything cheaper. Um, but anyway, I really like the vase. And uh, let's see what it looks like. So here it is. Um, it was $98. With shipping and tax and everything, it ended up being just under 120. It shipped very quickly and got here. And um, here's my only um, negative, is I wasn't able to buy both colors. It came in red and it came in white, studded collars, vase. Um, it says the size is two liters, but when I tried to order the other one, it says you're not allowed to buy more than one of one style. And I feel like when it comes to the home stuff, it cannot, it shouldn't be in the same category as clothing um, or accessories like that. I mean, it's a vase. So why wouldn't I want to have the red one and then the white one? So I chose between the two and I got the red. We'll see what it looks like. Um, I definitely like that it has like a little edge to it, the bondage aspect. It's pretty cool in my opinion. So wrapping is pretty good. Okay. So, oh, that's cool. So they, it comes with two Supreme stickers. I guess I'll find something to do with it. And the main box itself is now smaller. Hopefully it arrived in one piece. Wrapped very well, just lots of protection. Ooh. even more protection. So here it is. Oh my God. 
I love it even more and I'm it makes me even more pissed off that I can't get the white one. So here it is. Studded collars vase. It's much bigger than I thought it was. I like how it has the collars and the cuffs. It's like kind of goth looking, which I think is cool. Heavy, nice material. On the bottom it says Supreme and the collars themselves have Supreme written on them. I mean, just overall, it is very cool. Um, I'm like, why not let me have the white one? Because they would look so cool next to each other, just opposing colors. But red is one of my favorite colors and it definitely is cool to me. I definitely like the size, you know, it is definitely a fair color and just, the look of it, I find it kind of definitely badass. Like, what is not to like about this? I don't know if I'll ever use it for anything. I mean, technically, you could probably put flowers in it and other things. I read online that some people want to ash into this, but that's not really something that I would do. But from a decorative standpoint, I think it's very cool. You know, it's edgy, it's unique. Not everyone is going to have it. So, uh, you know, what's not to like? And the size is pretty cool, too, and Supreme. You know, the news just came out that Supreme was sold to, um, I think, VF Holdings. It's the parent company of Vans, Timberland, um, at Timberland, and the North Face for, like, $2.1 And, you know, great job to the people that founded this company. You know, they created a counterculture that they liked and it blew up and I mean the drops are just insane how fast everything sells out and they've earned it. I know a lot of people are now concerned that like oh is this not going to end up in a big box store and lose the value and all this but you know I don't think so. I think if they keep up with the formula and they maintain this exclusivity and popularity then it'll just continue to be as it was at the end of the day supply and demand so if people want the stuff they're gonna buy the stuff and um yeah i mean the most recent drop included timberland boots with the supreme on it so perhaps this possibly was only made to be because of the deal so anyway, this is my Supreme vase that I got from the drop. Honestly, I like it. I think it's pretty cool. I think it's very unique. It could definitely be a conversation piece, you know, and limited. It's not going to be available. And uh, at the end of the day, I liked it and that's why I bought it. Um, do I think it's worth $98? I mean, as far as this is obviously like I imagine some sort of mass produced thing. So at the end of the day, it's the value that you put on this uh, thing. This is just a random red vase that they put the collars on and then the Supreme logo on the bottom. Um, I mean, it's like anything, you know, why are Nike sneakers worth what they worth? Why is Apple worth getting for the cost that it is? Because you want it and you're willing to pay for it and uh, yeah, so this is the studded collars, vase in red. And I don't know, the website is very good because I keep trying to buy the white one. Um, but I guess they either track you through your address or your telephone number or your card number, whatever it is. But they're like, you've already ordered this. You can't order more than one in one style. That is definitely something that I think Supreme should change. I understand about the people that buy it for the sake of reselling it. Uh, but that's not me. And I feel like at least when it comes to like a vase, something like this, I don't think it falls into the same category as like someone buying every hat in every color in one uh, in one deal. But that being said, um, yeah. Thank you for watching this. I'm gonna add it now to the collection of everything that I have all over the place. Um, like and subscribe and we'll make more videos. Thanks guys. Bye.